Right, you've already said that. Can Tails prevail over the, this uh, rematch from uh, last time? I'm sure he can. Tails not a, not only fights, but he learns. And when someone beats you, he's just then more determined to come back and rub it in your face. I can, I can guarantee a victory for Tails here tonight. By any means necessary, Tails is going to get the victory. And well, here we go with these two squaring off, and uh, Link already catching Tails off guard already with a clothesline. But Tails back into the assault straight away, and oh, delivers his own clothesline in the corner. Tails goes behind Link, and he countered with a nice flip, and uh, Tails got a look, two f couple of boots in his uh, gut. These two are very calculating with their moves. It's going to be a very technical match once again, like it was last time. Until it, t until one of them decides to turn it into a boxing match. These two know what they're doing. So th they make for a great match. Hell's already going for a quick cover and he gets a one count for it, but uh, follows up with this Irish whip. And uh, misses with the clothesline though. That's going to cost him. Oh, Link tried to dive in, but uh, did not get any body on body. Oh, wait a minute. The mounted position and now Link driving those blunted fists right in the tail of his face. I tell you, Manic has a decent tag team partner in this guy. I will give him credit for that. He did a wise decision putting him on his team and Link luckily accepted. Well, I'm sure Link wants to get more recognized and what better than to uh, be in one of the uh, high-profile matches on Survivor Series and uh, try and, of course, win it and the whole aim of the game is to survive and to win and uh, Link is uh, winning so far here but uh, Tails comes back with a Nate breaker trying to follow up Link gets back to his feet trying to keep Tails at bay and uh, tell him to bring it and Tails sure did bring it and got punched and kicked down for it Tails is probably in a one set mind. He's probably on attack, attack, attack for hum humiliating him last week on uh, Smashdown. One. He does not want to get humiliated again, Two. but he needs to stay focused. That's what Tails is, has trouble Three. doing lately: is keeping his rage in. Four. And they're on the outside of the moment, roughly has a ten count to utilize. Five. He's up to five now. And uh, Tails continues Six. the assault on the outside, but back into the ring now as roughly gets up to seven. But uh, Link gets back in, and now we back into the ring, and uh, Tails still thrown off guard here. Like I said, he can't contain his rage as of late. He's getting very angry. Perhaps uh, too much coffee. He needs anger management is what he needs. But uh, Tails has said he, ha he can't sleep at night because of that v loss against Link and uh, oh wait a minute Tails reversed down into the armbar and now he's wrenching away Link won't be able to do any punches after this torture unless he's gonna tap here he's not gonna tap yet Link has a strong heart but Tails is that good at submissions that he's probably already taken out Link's arms at least here's a roll up cover and oh that was a close fall there Link probably still suffering from his arms and uh, that punch proved it all because Tails was able to block that, block that one and now Tails is back into the game perhaps but Link comes back up of misses with the clothesline and you can see him feeling his arm as Tails charges him down with all his body and uh, Tails is rather fat well he is in the games anyway and uh, Tails still using this ground and pound technique getting Link on the ground where he of course Link cannot of of course do much when Link is in vertical he's not very dangerous he can't do things like that but uh, you can still feel the effects but, but wait a minute look out for Tails oh and that sweet chin that super kick wasn't necessarily sweet chin music but he's still the same effect but Tails got out after two. Oh, wait a minute now Link he could be putting Tails away for a second time here. This is a big shock here. Tails is more unfocused on this occasion. I wouldn't blame him actually if he got a loss here. 
Here's the cover. Is he going to pick up another win for Manix team? But he's not. And this match continues. And Tails zooms around and now with a big shot so right to the back. And his German suplex to follow up. Tails is back in the zone. Once again, a second win perhaps. After taking two super kicks to right to the face. And now he's playing on perhaps delivering his own kind of music. It's the sound of Link's body hitting the canvas with that Techno Slam. And the Techno Slam connects, and oh no, here we go. This is when Tails is deadly, working on those legs with the submission hold. His powerful submission hold, almost a modified figure four as he salutes to the crowd saying, this one's over, man. And it could well be Link is very close to tapping out here. Um, wait a minute, Link is close to tapping, but Manic, oh, he came in with it, he's got a trash can, and he just nailed Tails with a couple of times with it. That's a disqualification, though, without a doubt. I was totally out of control, Tails picks up a victory here, wait a minute, he's not finished, it doesn't look like. Manic is not finished here by the looks of it, but he did not want Link to suffer a, a tap-out victory or to perhaps injure his leg, because as we see, Manic has been injured by that move and several others applied he doesn't want Link to suffer the same fate but oh no I'm getting out of here this doesn't look good I'm getting out of here too oh my god F you time oh my god my god Manic came through the crowd and he's just put Tails away here what a F you through the announce table with a tremendous amount of impact, Link back to his feet and now they're looking at the destruction that is the team captain if you want to send any messages, there was a message right there at the hands of our announce table it got put to uh, an alternate kind of use, let's say and now Manic is standing tall and wow, I can't wait for this match folks and now Manic has said it wants to be a 10 person so we have a two mystery, we have four mystery partners to be on the teams now, perhaps. But uh, we will have to find out at Survivor Series if that is official, but it'd be great if it was. Also at Survivor Series, as we do continue the countdown here, of course, there is the Handicap Hardcore match. Bowman and Wario are going in with no momentum, but Nightmare has to survive the main event, which is up next. Can he do that? Bowman and Wario are going to be paying close attention to that match because uh, the results, of course, are going to affect Nightmare's ability to defend the hardcore title. And then, of course, we have Astros defending his YouTube Championship. The only YouTube Champion to have here on Smashdown is for once in completely deep jeopardy of losing the championship because Bart has won the right to select what match it is and he has selected three stages of hell. Also, over on Raw, it's a number one contenders match for the Women's Championship as Cream, the ever so deadly Cream, shall we call her, a changed girl going after Decal to get to Amy, who of course uh, they will collide at Armageddon, whoever uh, gets the victory here. Can Decal survive against a very enraged Cream? Also, a tag team match for traditional rules as uh, Eggman and Mandy look to take on Mindy and Star competing for the first time ever. But can Eggman and Min Mandy overcome the opposition? Because if they do, Eggman, you get to be general manager or co general manager. Sorry, I keep on messing up there. <laughs> co general manager, definitely like the sound of that. And let's not forget our main event for Survivor Series, a huge six-man elimination tag team match. Metal Knuckles, Chaos, and Team Captain Sonic taking on Team Captain Mario, Metal Sonic, and Aki with both the Intercontinental and World Championships on the line in a title unification match to decide who will be the ultimate, the explicit, the unique, the undisputed ASF champion. And well... If you thought that was huge, then we, we've got still this cage match coming up. It's going to be the death of uh, Nightmare, as Astros put it. But, uh, well, I can't wait to see this clash. It's going to be an interesting one. It was an inevitable clash, because these two are from the, these two are from the